Hey guys, it's iOS Reviews here, reviewing the top 10 Cydia apps of this week. And number 5 we have Acon Icon Changer. This will basically change the contrast, the zipper, all of that crap you can put onto it. So for example, black and white, glass, invert, x-ray, vibrant, bloom, saturate, contrast, zipper, and so on. Basically, I started having problems with this. Not like you would, it's just when I had the recorder out, it just wouldn't work. As you can see here, it just wouldn't work when I tapped the home button to make it work. It was still black and white. But it did work after I re reverted it back to originals, which it has on the options on the app. Next, at number four, we have Winterboard. Winterboard is basically a good, it's an okayish theme. And if you want to use it, you just press select themes, go on, and then choose what ones you want. I'm not going to respring my device here because it would just stop the recording. But you can download any themes that you want through Cydia and so on. You can also make themes for Winterboard as well. I heard it's quite easy. As you can see, advanced for themes at the bottom for anyone who's interested in doing themes. You can edit. You can also turn on summer board and hide winter board as well. Woo! At number three, we have iFlux, which is a brightness changer. This will save you a hell of a lot of battery if you're low. Basically, you can change the kilowatts that's used to make the screen glow and basically this app has saved my batteries are so many times it will dim the screen the darkest you've ever dimmed your screen trust me and the cool thing about it it's got night and day mode and if you put your location in it will change to night and day so your lights could be different so say if you want to be secretive at night for some reason dirty bastards you could do that at number two we have Dreamboard. Dreamboard is a better theme app which will basically let you choose between themes already set out. So I'm just going to choose OS 7 here at the 7 and this is a Windows 7 phone theme. It's basically got all the apps, it's just like it. Except the lock screen doesn't change, that's the problem with um, Dreamboard. But still, as you can see, icon still works, so you can still keep your icons black and white and so on. It just doesn't work on calendar and so on. Some apps doesn't work on. You can also pin apps to the start menu oh. to make it really look like a Windows phone, so you could have your own apps and customize it. Next we have PP, which gives you free paid apps. This is one of the best ones because installers is gone now. What you have to do is type in, in the search bar what you want. So I'm going to type in bad piggies. So slowly. It is in Japanese. I don't understand it, but I don't know how to use it. You want to click on the left button, which I click on. You want to switch to downloads. And it'll start downloading. Once downloaded, I click this. You click on the controller. And then you click on the button there to the right of the um, application and then you just wait and it will change back to what it was a, like a minute ago and that means your application is installed that sync one which I won't go on which is YouTube and Facebook that was to update thank you for watching and this has been the top 10 city app reviews by iOS reviews please like and subscribe thank you